Today at Brooks, we are having the local WSTL competition. At this competition, each school is allowed to bring four participants in each of the categories, and there's five different categories. There's graphic design, website design, video PSA, video news story, and interactive media. We have four schools this year participating. It's Coleman, Hadley, um, Curtis, and, and ourselves. We come together to give them an experience to, to present and show their project to, to other schools and to have it judged by judges. They'll also have the opportunity to go to a state competition at Kansas State University and compete with other students across, this, across the state. This is a metaphor, and we put two is the metaphor on each question. So if you type one, it'll pop up this. Uh... Student technology leadership is it's for more like the advanced students in technology, like not necessarily they're good at building it, but they're good at using it. What we do is more advanced stuff that's not what everybody else does, because other classes they have a set curriculum, STL really doesn't. My class this year set up computers for our science labs, unbox them, set them up, and we may help uh, other students or teachers with technology issues if they got some software that doesn't work or how to connect a projector or something. So we try to be leadership, leaders in technology across the school. We created our video using Adobe Premiere Elements 12.0 and the Sony Handycam 9.2 megapixel camera for filming. The thing I like about the STL competition is that it's competitive and um, you can actually work with your friends on this stuff instead of being put with people your teacher chooses. You can do whatever, it's just as long as you follow your topic guidelines. I think they get, it, get the sense of accomplishment. They just don't do a project one time and turn it in and go to the next one. They, they uh, have to design it, they build, create it, um, they edit it, and make uh, revisions to it, and they may do that several times. Um, then they'll um, get the experience to present that and they get some critique and feedback and then they can use that to improve it and, and enhance it for future. So um, it's, a, it's a long process that's teaching them how to be successful from start to finish. This year, I feel way more confident than I did last year about my project because the way the judges had reacted after we have presented or while the presentation, way much better. And in first place in web design is uh, Edward from Brooks. We will do um, awards for the first six p um, places, so the, um, from sixth, fifth, and fourth will get a certificate, and then uh, first, the top three awards will get a, uh, a little um, small plaque that we printed on our 3D printers for first, second, and third. Um, and then after that, a lot of schools who use this as um, uh, kind of a judging tool to who will they decide to take to the state competition in April at uh, Kansas State University. All right, this is our final category, uh, video production news story. I think it's went fairly smooth. Kids, kids are getting a good experience in presenting, and, and the pres presentations I've sat in on have went really well.